All right, more to hustle. We got Janai. Throw it on the line. Hey, good morning. How are y'all doing? We are hey. great. Listen, man, people out here filing for bankruptcy because of unpaid medical bills. And uh, <laughs> listen, a lot of people have been sick in these last couple of years. So uh, we definitely been seeing that uptick happen. So listen, Headcrack, you're right. You know, with inflation and everything going on right now, people are like, how can we save some money on medical expenses? So let's jump into it. We can talk about everything from prescriptions, contacts, glasses, whatever people need to know about. Okay, so if people want to save money, since you said glasses and contacts, what are some of the best places to buy those? Um, Which is funny, the number one leader for saving money on glasses and contacts happens to be Costco. Headcrack is like their number one uh, promoter, and now you're number two. I kind of want to be their (laughs) their version of Progressive Flow. Like, they don't have a mascot, they need one, I could be that guy. Yeah, I live there. I know it. But um, if you're trying to save money on contact lenses, you can go to a place called Contact Lens King, lens.com, and also Costco. And again, for glasses, go to Costco. And one of my favorites is Warby Parker. How do you shop around for, like, the best price on medical procedures or, like, medical supplies? A lot of people don't realize that shopping around before you get a medical procedure done is really a good idea. I mean, obviously, it's not just about price. Clearly, you want to be dealing with somebody reputable, but you need to have a full financial conversation before you get the procedure done. Um, Obviously, you want to start with whoever's in your network first, and then you want to begin to start contacting some other doctors as well. But there's a website you could go to. It's called Healthcare Blue Book. Healthcare Blue Book, and another one is called Amino, A-M-I-N-O, where you can type in the procedure that you need done, your zip code, and it's going to let you know physicians in your area that offer the procedure and also at what price. Now, some people just go to Mexico. Is that considered out of network as well (laughs) or no? Um, definitely out of network, but it's funny. Um, people who I know who live in Texas in particular absolutely are going over the border, particularly for um, dental procedures. Some of y'all coming back with animal teeth. I see yeah. it. Yeah, I know girls that go for Botox. I'm like, I hope one half of their face don't be lifted higher than the earth. So does medical debt impact your credit score differently than other debts? Um, it actually does impact your credit score differently. Mm. And it's actually to our advantage that it does because it takes longer for your medical debt to post to your credit report. And part of the reason is it's giving us more time in order to work things out with our medical provider. You're normally given a six-month grace period for medical debt. And that's with all three credit reporting agencies, Experian, TransUnion, and Equifax. So it normally won't take, again, six months before it's going to pop up again. So you can work things out with the hospital, your provider, to give you a chance to get on track. When they start sending them envelopes to your house yeah. that are a different color than the other ones. <laughs> that green know. one. <laughs> <laughs> that green, that yellow, that pink. You know they've been looking for your ass. Yo. Well, I'm trying to figure out why you know about that. Because <laughs> <laughs> I've ignored quite a few bills in my day. <laughs> you <see? laughs> Very busy over here. Well, yo, Janai, thank you so much for tapping in as usual. And if people want to follow you so they can get more information about this and other financial things, where can they go? Of course, you can follow me at Janai Thornton. That's J-I-N-I-T-H-O-R-N-T-O-N. And ladies, you can join my free money community at thankmelater.money. There it is, man. One time for the one, the only, our city girl, JT, Janai Thornton. Hey! Y'all have a great Monday. Y'all take care. You too. You too. We are the Morning Hustle.